here for Mackay to take the shot on. So unlucky with Holy beaten. And still the danger, maybe. This time it's in by Grimes. It's Leroy Fair. And how close Barry Mackay came here. It is aimed in towards him. The flick on before it got that far. Takes it just wide from McBurney. Another who can thrive with this sort of service. Everybody still forward in the blue and black, but it's uh, Irvin Mulder's ball. Comfortable enough claim for the keeper. Who releases it very quickly. And it may still come to Mackay. Zach Wally wasn't quite aware of where the ball was. It's now at the fit of Barry Mackay. It's fair. Time to take a touch. McBurney! Stayed onside to open the scoring. Swansea's top scorer is at it again. Just ten minutes in, and it's Ollie McBurney that has the championship side in front. A dozen goals for the season and counting. Just not picked up really by the Gillingham defence. Timed his run beautifully to step in between the two defenders. have worked this well for Mackay. Numbers arriving in support as well. And that was an important block. He just took a little too long to get his shot away. Taking up a very promising position again, though, Connor Roberts. <laughs> Serena slipping it through for Declan John to the summer signings combined. And he delivers the cross. I couldn't quite get to it. Roberts will here. This is fair. Selena. John again. And delivering dangerously. Nobody quite could get the definitive touch goalwards. And Thomas Holy, the big Czech goalkeeper, is relieved to be able to gather it up. That's a beautiful ball dinked in there on his left favoured right foot by Declan John. Thomas Holy able to uh, get his giant frame down to gather it up in the end. And here's McBurney, he's covered good ground, McBurney again! Doubles the lead for Swansea City. Here's an inside second goal of the afternoon already, took it clinically. He's a man in the mood. And Swansea, it seems, already well on their way to round five. He creates that room in which to work again and brings Declan John into it. Squaring up to O'Neill and then uh, going past O'Neill. It will come for Leroy Fair. Options in white in the middle. McBurney to try and attack it. Roof of the net this time. All oh, that separates only McBurney from being able to claim that match ball. Gillingham were stretched here. Rose really well to win it. Roy Fair into the fit of McBurney again, but it's nicked away from them by Byrne. He does have support here from List. This is Elliot List. Marshalled by Carter Vickers. He's forced him wide. List in no mood to give it up, though. Doesn't have a lot by way of immediate support available. But he's done brilliantly to pick out Byrne. With the ball in! Back in the game! On the end of it is Josh Rees. Wonderfully worked by Gillingham. Rees gets the goal. And they have hope again. Just got to it ahead of Van der Horn to beat Mulder with the header. It's back in again, Van der Horn couldn't quite touch it in. He felt he was fouled in the process as he flung himself at that in front of goal. Ogilvy just got a touch to it ahead of Van der Horn. Selina, Grimes. A little bit of space maybe for the shot. to make it 3-1 a goal to remember from Bas and Selina should wrap up the cup tie 
invited to have a hit, and how he has stepped up on the big stage. There is space here for Gillingham as they look for the instant respond and look for something spectacular of their own, not quite this time. And that might sum up some of the difference, Luke O'Neill's effort not troubling the target. This is Hanlon, trying to find the uh, time to turn, and it's a really smart stop from Mulder, who got down well to keep that out, might have been a little unsighted. The effort from O'Neill, and the ball fell at him, thanks to some strong play from Brandon Hanlon. And here comes Swansea. Selina helping it on, James now on the charge. And all sorts of space for him to look up and pick out his man, and it's turned in. 4-1, Swansea are running away with it, Mackay in there, but he goes to afford the credit to the man that made it, Daniel James. Swansea City in complete command, and heading for round five of the Emirates FA Cup. Swansea at the other end with James. Shifts into space beautifully and delivers deep. Met by Fulton and blocked importantly, impressively on the near post. Swansea have not settled here for four. And it goes again. And everybody trying to stay onside, but behind it goes, and that will do it. A productive afternoon for Graham Potter and Swansea City. Six unbeaten now, the longest such sequence of his tenure. And Swansea through to round five.